YouTube is a great way to get your videos in front of a large audience. But what if you need video features that YouTube doesn't have? In this video, we'll take a look at Vimeo and how you can set up your courses straight from your Vimeo showcase. Hey there Dashers, Michael here, content creator for LearnDash LMS. So you're ready to create your online course, but you've caught yourself wondering how long it's gonna take to actually get these videos onto a platform for your new course. Well, you're in luck. You can save time building your course lessons using the course creation wizard feature in LearnDash so you can set up your online course with your existing audience. You know, it's quite common to see video as a typical teaching tool in online courses today. In fact, in today's market, it's almost expected and for good reason. Video lessons allow your learners to benefit from a visual and auditorial style of learning that can increase engagement. Now, whilst YouTube is a free resource that you can host your video content on, for a paid course or program, you may want to look at options like Vimeo that have some benefits that YouTube may not include. Let's explore some of these benefits and compare the two options. YouTube. YouTube is a well-known online video sharing and social media platform. No, it isn't just for cat lovers to browse their cat videos. You can also upload educational content as well. Now let's take a look at some of the pros and cons of YouTube. Without a doubt, the biggest pro of YouTube is that YouTube is free. You can easily set up a new account and start uploading content without the need to add a credit card. The second pro of YouTube is that being one of the largest search engines on the internet, YouTube exposes your videos to a larger audience for consumption. But this is probably not ideal if you intend to protect your course content. Additionally, you should have no issues navigating YouTube. It's pretty easy to get a video uploaded on the platform. And lastly, you can upload unlimited amounts of video onto your channel with no restrictions on file size. Now let's look at some of the cons. If you're offering paid content, your students, including anyone who has a link, can easily access your course videos and share with others. Not ideal for your paid programs. Secondly, YouTube adds recommended videos and advertisements to videos uploaded, which may not resonate with your course content and isn't good for student retention. Your content also has the potential to be flagged for copyright abuse and YouTube has all the rights to take it down at any time. Now let's compare with Vimeo. Vimeo, similar to YouTube, is a video hosting, sharing, and services platform provider that offers professional features for a nominal fee. Here are some of the pros. Vimeo has advanced privacy options, so you can lock down your videos to ensure that only your students have access to your content. You can also lock down your content to the domain so that your content can only be accessed on your WordPress website. Unlike YouTube, Vimeo has 24-7 around-the-clock support via their support team to help you troubleshoot or assist in navigating the platform. With Vimeo, there are no external ads or distractions, so your students can focus primarily on your course. You can also customize your player with chapters, ad logos, and branding to the player as an added feature. Let's say you'd like to upgrade your course videos, but you don't want to switch the link in your LearnDash course each time. With Vimeo, you can replace the existing video with a new upload without having to make an additional step in your online course. If you need in-depth analytics from your students for viewer retention and the frequency at which your students are watching, Vimeo also has this added feature. Now, let's look at some of the cons. Vimeo has a free option, but for course creators, you're not going to be able to get by with the restrictions on upload or storage, and you'll lose out on all the additional features we've previously spoke about. Additionally, Vimeo's interface can be a bit confusing to navigate, but once you've gone through a few uploads, you should get more familiar uploading the content. Personally, I think the benefits of Vimeo as far as protecting my precious video content is enough for the investment of Vimeo, but we've laid out the differences so that you can decide. The LearnDash course creation wizard supports both platforms, so you're not losing out on that front. Now, if you decide to go with Vimeo, I'm gonna show you how to use the course creation wizard to get set up for your new online course. Before we begin, let's look at the course creation wizard, what it is and what it does. 
The Course Creation Wizard allows you to easily create and publish courses using a YouTube playlist, a Vimeo showcase, or a Wistia project URL. Simply by entering the playlist URL, the wizard automatically loads all the data that is needed and creates the course with lessons corresponding to the individual videos in the playlist. The wizard is designed to save you tons of time embedding new lessons into your new online course so you can focus on the things that matter, which is selling your course. Now let's look at how to set the Vimeo Showcase. Once you've successfully uploaded your videos into your Vimeo account, head over to the Video Manager. You can create a new showcase directly from the Video Manager by clicking the plus button next to the showcases in the left panel. You'll be taken to a page where you can input the showcase's title, description, then set its privacy level and add videos. To add a video to a showcase, follow these steps. Press the gray add video button. Select the content you would like to add to the showcase from the light box and press add to save your changes. The format in which videos are laid out are going to affect the order in LearnDash, so be sure to arrange them in proper order. Now that you have your showcase set up, copy the playlist link from your Vimeo account. To use the course creation wizard, navigate to LearnDash LMS, head over to courses, click on the create from video playlist button at the top right, Copy and paste your Vimeo showcase into the URL field presented within the wizard. Click the load the playlist data button. From here, you will be presented with options on the course access settings and the course progression. Once you're done loading the playlist, you will then be presented with the course access settings. You can select the one that you want to be applied to the course. You can find out more about course access types by clicking on the link in the description. Once you're done setting the course access settings and course progression, click on the create the course to create your courses and lessons. Take note that the course and lessons will be automatically set to publish status. Once the course is created, you'll be taken back to the courses page. From here, you can edit and update the courses and lessons that you create. Each lesson that is created from the course will contain the specific video and a transcript of the video lesson. You can set and update the content of each lesson as you please. And that's all there is to it. LearnDash's drag and drop interface makes it easy to convert your outline into a full course quickly and easily. If you're not already using LearnDash, try out a free demo to take us for a test drive. I'll leave a link in the description below and whether you need a simple way to create a course website from scratch or you're looking to create a course on your existing WordPress website, LearnDash has a solution for every course and for every course creator. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to be the first to see our latest tips, tricks and tutorials. We can't wait to see what you create next.